construct the angle of the following measurement that's of 30 degree so first is we'll take a line segment and me use a thin line okay so at this point let's construct a 30 degree how do we do that with a as a center draw an arc of any radius so this is a b this is point d wherein the arc and the line segment meet that's your d from d with the same radius cut one arc this will give you radius reason being all these lengths are equal so this will be 60 degree now we need to bisect this so we need we are bisecting between 0 degree and 60 degree okay so we are bisecting between 0 degree comma 60 degree so what is the average of 0 and 60 so what is the average of 0 and 60 it is 0 plus 60 by 2 that is 30 degree so that will be around somewhere over there and yeah how do you get this point sorry i didn't tell you guys that so angular bisector so from point b and d take an arc whose length uh, draw an arc whose length is more than half the length of bd so from b and d if you cut two arcs you'll get a point which will bisect this particular angle okay so now let's have a look at the video which has your you know pen paper and so on and so forth okay so do the same with along with me so first i already drawn in line segment then we have an arc of any radius doesn't matter so point of intersection of the arc and the line segment draw one more arc so we have that to be 60 degree so now we need to bisect that particular angle i have not shown the construction i mean i have not joined that 60 degree it's not required so that will be your 30 degree that's it so joining that will give you 30 degree right the logicals logic is also quite simple so as you can see clearly that is 30 degree please understand with logic it then it becomes very simple so come back to your screen so we have the steps of construction take a as a center and let's call this as a b with a as a center and some radius draw an arc of of a circle that's an arc which intersects a b and d so that's d taking d as a center with with same radius this is very important that we need to stick to same radius as before draw an arc intersecting the arc one at e so that will be your e with e and d as center draw arc with radius more than half the length of ed right so more than half of this draw two arcs like this so they intersect at point p and pab will give you guys 30 degree so here you have your question this is the funda kind of bisection funda and this is your steps of construction please enroll to our program at chalkpeaceacademy.com wherein we'll be teaching you a lot more tricks for faster simplification calculation uh, diy projects we'll code with python we'll work with arduino uno there are a lot more magic tricks and the physics behind it.
they are printable materials which will help you recap and understand things better we'll have live revision and doubt session two months before your term exams it's very cost effective there would be no ads or any kind of distractions and we have a dedicated app to help you guys with this